Hi, this is Steve and thank you for watching this video. I want to talk specifically about positive thinking and it's not quite what I think you might be thinking. Just to elaborate on that, there's certain train of thought out there that says, look, positive thinking means everything. If you think positively, good things will come. And as an example of that, there are people who will say, who will quote to you all the time, what you think is what you will be, is what you will become, is what you will receive. And so it, that applies to what we might call negatives or positives. So if you were thinking, well, golly, um, I've got no money in the bank, I'm going to be broke for the rest of my life, well, chances are that you're going to be correct. Whereas on the other side of the coin, if you think, well, you know, tomorrow is a new day, I think I'm going to do well, I think things are going to turn around for me, I think money or riches or fame or wealth is going to come my way, well, sure, that's, uh, that's going to happen too. And that's generally what people say to you. Uh, and that certainly is my experience from being around for a few years uh, as an online marketer. But I think there's a lot more to it than that. And I've, um, I've been watching a few videos recently, very recently, which go into that. And I'm not going to sort of tell you what the videos were right now. I'll keep that for a bit later. But needless to say, it's not just about the way you think. I mean, you can think all you like, good stuff, bad stuff. Um, thinking alone isn't going to cut the mustard. Let me give you another example. You can think, okay, I think I'm going to be super rich in three months' time, as an example. In three months' time, or so, three months' time arrives and you're exactly in the same place you were three months earlier. No surprises there. And of course, people will then say after a while, that's just a pile of baloney, this, you know, this positive thinking or this perhaps this think and grow rich type of mentality. It's just baloney, it doesn't, doesn't work. In fact, that would be right. It, it just doesn't work on its own. What it requires is not just a mind shift. It's not just the way that you think. And you can say it out loud, which is always good. And you can write things down. For example, I want to be able to have enough money in the bank to buy my favourite $100,000 car by the end of the year, whether that's three months away, six months away, whatever it might be. But you need to follow, follow that up with some sort of an action that's going to get it there. But now you, you need to marry the two together. This is the tricky part. You're thinking about it. You might even cut a picture out of the car you want, stick it on the fridge, on your computer, above the ceiling, above your, you know, above your bed, uh, whatever you might think about it every day. That's the car I want. You might go to the car dealership and take the thing for a drive. Yeah, all that is good positive stuff. But it's not enough. You need not only to look at it, see it and think it and believe it, but you've also got to change your life in a way that is going to, ex it's going to want to attract it to you. It's the power of attraction, I suppose you could say. And there is, there is a law out there about the power of attraction and it marries in with the power of positive thinking as well. So, time for another example. It's great if I was to say I want that particular car and I'm thinking it, I've got all the pictures cut out, I take it for a test drive, but then I go about the rest of my day as I have always done, which may be, look I can't quote you from an average person's point of view on what their day to day might be, but Let's just, let's just go with this one. Let's just say that the average person might be sort of 
more negative than they are positive. You know, oh, I've got all these bills coming in. I don't like my job. I hate my boss. Oh, it's raining outside. Boo hoo. Or oh, gee, it's weather's too hot. Oh, I'm sunburnt. Oh, life's a life's a bitch. Oh, you know that sort of thing. Okay, and I'm probably over exaggerating that just a little bit, but you get the drift. I hope. So if this is a person's normal day-to-day -day life, but then they take a little snippet of, I want that car, and post pictures on the fridge and think about it and dream about it, and talk about it, but then 99% of the rest of their life is all this negativity going on, you're not going to see your car materialize it won't happen you've got to make life changes in the way you think the way you act towards people treat other people and i don't mean you need to go out there and try and change other people's lives that's exactly not what i'm saying it's got to come from within you the way you think you're responsible for what you think and how you think and how you act and how you are towards other people and to life in general. Every time you sense you're negative, and this is just a bit of a hint here as to how you can change, help change yourself if you wish to, is every time you sense or you can feel that you're being negative or you're, you know, you're about to comment, darn weather outside, I'll tell you what, this is pits, don't say it. Think, hang on a sec, I'm grateful for that weather because if we didn't have that weather, we might have something else that I don't like, or we might, or, or, or the weather could be worse, or it could be so many other variables. No, I think the weather is how it is, can't be controlled. I'm grateful for that. I'm grateful that I'm alive to see what we've got out in the world, the weather, where we live. I'm grateful that I have my health, if indeed you have your health. Be grateful. Being grateful is a, a huge step in the right direction towards that change thinking, which I'm trying to sort of get across to you. It's a big subject, and this is a bit of a, a large or a longish intro video to it, which I apologise for. I was only going to make this a few minutes long, but I just can't seem to do that. So I haven't got a title for this yet. It's a change which I'm going to invoke in my own life. I'm going to bring into being. I want to share it with others. I don't have a name for it yet. I will have a name for it when I think of it. I'll share it as well. There'll be more videos. And um, there'll be a Facebook group I'll be starting. Nothing at all to do with selling stuff. It's to do with what I've just talked about. Although I'm an affiliate marketer, it won't have anything to do with it. Trust me on that. Okay, so that's it for this video. Look out for my next one. My next video is going to have more detail. Hopefully it won't be as long as this intro video. And there'll be more, much more videos to follow. Stay good, think positively. Be grateful for whatever you can every day of the week. And I'll expect you soon. This is Steve and catch you later.